This is a tutorial to create an augmented reality work of art with the iJack app. We're going to use an image that will then trigger an animation or a video when viewed through the app on another device. Hey, so I'm going to show you how to create a easy augmented reality artwork uh, that can be triggered um, using iJack. So this is iJack Creator, and once you log in, you could just click the Create a New Artwork tab. Um, and this is really pretty simple. So it says to drop your file here. Um, and this is where you're adding the uh, image that will be the trigger. Um, so it, it helps if you line up that image with the actual uh, video that you're going to use. So I'm using the one of the first frames from the video um, so that it will uh, be fairly seamless. Uh, and then you can go ahead and press next. Um, and the second step is to add your video, GIF, uh, PNG, sequence, or animation. Um, and I'm going to actually add the poem. And you notice that it is the same aspect ratio, so it'll line up and look really good. It will actually seem like the image uh, is part of the final piece. And they do have a couple tips here. You could add external sound. Uh, it helps to make sure that your piece is at 25 frames per second. Um, and then you actually just hit create. So this is how simple that it is. It takes a couple of seconds to uh, upload um, and then you get a QR code. So this QR code will actually um, trigger and this is a good way to test your image to see if it works. Uh, so I'm gonna grab my cell phone um, and make sure that this works. Just point the smartphone at it and you'll see the animation come to life with augmented reality. And it's that simple. Uh, so once you are done, uh, the next step is to just literally hit done. Um, and then you have a couple of different options. So it is published um, and you could add a little description so people know what it is. Um, and I'm gonna write a AR video poem since that's what my piece is. Um, and you could share with this link and preview it here. Um, so I'm gonna hit save and share. And there you go, you have a link that now works. Um, really easy to do, only a couple steps. Um, this is one of the least complicated methods to create really engaging augmented reality. You could take something like a sign or an image, uh, keep it in your classroom uh, and use it as an AR trigger. One of the ways that I like to use this is to make an augmented reality art gallery in my classroom and in the hallway of the school. So I'll share more about that later, but I just wanted to share some of how this tool works and how simple it is. So if you have any questions, please drop them in um, the comment section and I'm happy to help.